it's, it's refreshing to see new people come in every year, like clockwork, bringing in energy and vitality and reminding us why we, why we got into occupational ministry in the first place. There's that sense of, I touched some lives and now those lives have touched me. Seeing how uh, they live their lives for Jesus and um, the underlying inner life of their passion uh, to serve Jesus and to serve his church, especially through this internship committee. We learn by experience, by seeing, by, by repetition, by what goes on being real. I think the fun part is being able to see as the year develops with the intern, uh, some of their neat experiences, how they get excited about ministry. The changes that we see from the time they arrive till they leave is incredible. So it's not just about the intern, it's also about your own growth. I think an individual as well as a congregation really has that opportunity to really be part of national and global ministry because that's what you're doing when you're raising up a pastor. You're raising up a pastor for Christ and you are part of something bigger than yourself. Recently we had our 35th anniversary and uh, former interns came back. Uh, to, we were able to celebrate their ministry and they had to come back from all over the United States. Some who had done missions uh, uh, overseas or in South America. And so they were truly able to see the global impact of uh, their investment and of their effort and truly seeing the fruits uh, of God in those uh, endeavors. The mission of the congregation is in part to be a group of educators preparing uh, future leaders of the church. I think it's watching the intern grow throughout the year. When they come to us, they usually are you know, a little hesitant about how they're approaching things. And then all of a sudden you sort of see them turn the corner and become a part of our life and minister to us in a different way. And kind of just see them realizing the role of a minister rather than as, as a student. And really, I think it's about just having a, a passion and desire to share the, the hope which comes from the gospel of Jesus Christ. They, play a crucial part in the formation of a future leader. Um, so, much of, so much of what I'm thinking about and what I'll be bringing to my first call is coming from my experience on internship. My intern experience and my committee has really shaped how I view uh, the church community and the community of believers. I did not really understand the process of, of what a pastor did to become a pastor. Um, I think as a member of the church, member of a congregation and denomination, we kind of assume there will always be a pastor. I think it's our role really as individuals and church members and congregations that we provide for the future. Um, not only for ourselves very selfishly, but for those who come behind us. If we want strong leadership, it's our job, it's really our, it should be our passion to provide that. And uh, being around these young, uh, vibrant uh, interns has shown me what true calling is and maybe discovered a calling in myself that I didn't know was there. And uh, I guess a faith booster uh, is what this process has been for me.